The support has been amazing. It's been such a blessing. Laplace is coming together for the hundreds of Bayou Steel workers suddenly without a job. Good evening, everyone. I'm Katie Moore. And I'm Sharice Gibson. Last Monday, workers at Bayou Steel had their lives turned upside down when they were suddenly laid off. 376 people without a job and possibly without a paycheck for some time. But the Bayou St. John community is coming together to help the laid off workers. And our Erica Ferrando spent the day in Laplace. It's quite extraordinary to see that community coming together. What did you see today? Well, one thing I can tell you is that the former Bayou Steel employees <laughs> certainly should not be going hungry because people are giving them free meals left and right. They're getting free haircuts. And you can see how the community of Laplace is helping these workers get through this tough time. At the end of the day, God got us and we'll come out on top. Kerry Jones is getting ready for his fourth job interview in a week. Some doors close, bigger doors open. He's one of the 376 employees who suddenly lost their jobs at Bayou Steel. He was a mechanic there for five years. It was been a battle. But some people, like his friend Lee Zan Green, have made the battle a little easier. They're all going to job fairs. They all need jobs, so they got to look good. Green is a stylist at Studio Cuts, and she's giving free haircuts to former Bayou Steel employees. Everybody just kind of decided that they were going to rally together and do whatever they could to support the community. Her son is still working there until they permanently close. I plan on retiring there. Both have seen the community step up to help. If you're a Bayou Steel worker, you get out. Several restaurants in Laplace have been offering a free meal to all of these Bayou Steel employees. Popeyes was feeding Bayou Steel employees for free, and Saturday, the king of wings fed workers and their families a buffet breakfast. I took advantage of the Popeyes. I, I did take advantage of the Popeyes. Louisiana Federal Credit Union is offering loan deferrals and fee waivers. This is some of the big chicken that we'd be serving on tomorrow. And now Colbert Bot Clark is busy in the kitchen. To let the community see you're not eating this alone. Getting ready to feed hundreds at Bot's place. We're preparing for at least 200 to 250 people. Wednesday, he and the attorneys next door are hosting a lunch for Bayou Steel workers plus their families. The chef salad, baked chicken, uh, homemade cake. It's all free. But when something like this happens to someone, you want to be able to give back. Because a warm meal and a haircut is showing these workers that their community is behind them. Through the tough times that we're having, everything has been a blessing. This lunch tomorrow at Bot's Place in Laplace is from 11 to 1, and former Bayou Steel employees plus their families are invited for a free meal.